Hi guys from NC1. Today I'm going to show you I have with uh, RTH, especially for somebody who uses Spectrum or the radio. This is going to help you for the beginner one. And uh, even for Fly Sky or FR Sky. The FR Sky or F uh, FR Sky, both of them send no pulses. It's something good, better than this old version of a radio. But this radio sends pulses even at the lowest when you switch it off. Look carefully. It drop, but still send the minimum pulses. This is one of the big problems. Many people caught up and lose the plane because they will not turn back the plane. It will land far away from you or fly away. So what you have to do when you set up this plane, any other kind of a plane, make sure the first things you have to do is to switch off your radio. Now I'm at the moment, focus the camera, okay. It's at 1096. I'm gonna switch off my radio, watch carefully. It dropped to 968. So what you have to do, go to fail safe, fail safe tab, Come on, here we are. Watch carefully. I didn't put 968, I put 978. Just 10 step up. That's what I did. Then save it. Then go back to your receiver tab again. Switch it on your radio. Watch carefully. Look, this is no army. Look when I harm. Do you see channel five? It went all the way up. Now look carefully. This RTH is set. Look carefully. Can you see? Channel seven. Depends your radio which channel you're gonna set that. It's up to you. But make it sure, make it sure RTH and uh, army channel all the way up. If you, this does happen, your RTH fail safety will not work. So when you're binding, you need to bind these two channels, whatever channel you set, Armin and RTH, to your radio, your receiver radio on your plane. If you don't do that, it will not work. It will appear only one thing. This will appear on your screen. Fail safe, it will appear fail safe. A few seconds later, appear this one. Reset. And then if you see, it's gonna be five or 10 kilometers away, two kilometers away, it's gonna land. Switch off the motor, we switch off the motor, I test already, and drop your plane down. You don't wanna do that. Especially if you drop 10 kilometers, four kilometers away, it's a, a bigger deck. So, to go in full felt safe, it means return home function, you want this uh, two all the way up. Make sure you do that. In uh, FR Sky, a Fly Sky, they have no pulses, so the throttle will be all the way down. You will recognize a full, a full fail safe. But there is one problem. Even with that, check first if it doesn't work. If it doesn't not work, remember your army switch put up when you set up your computer radio to the receiver. It will appear the big headache you're gonna ever have, have. It will appear what you saw before. Watch carefully now. Hold on. Armin. Disarming. This will appear. Resetting bottom. You don't wanna see that. That's the danger way if you are far away. In the middle of the sky, it will do definitely in the middle of the sky. I've been tested with a different flight controller. That's what happened. So remember to set your arm switch on. Arm switch on your computer radio. Make sure this is up. If you have no pulses, leave your throttle all the way down to go and completely fail safe. And your computer, if you on I have, that was switch off. Watch carefully, it appear red light here. Can you see? RTH. Now let's go to my screen here. Watch carefully. Fail safe, RTH. It need to be like this. If you do not appear RTH in a spectrum, fail safe spectrum, remember that? RTH, RC link lost. 
Yeah? Now, because we are inside house, otherwise it will appear en route to home. So come back home. So at the moment when the motor doesn't switch it on, but it will work. What you have to do, you have to move 50 meters away, put the plane on the top of your head, and walk a bit faster as you can. Just reach 50 meters away because you have to do that. Otherwise, your GPS, it will not recognize your heading, your location. So when you move after 50 meters away, it'll start to recognize your heading, switch off your radio, it must appear that. If it doesn't do that, it will not work. It doesn't matter if you're, it's a fly sky, FRS sky, or spectrum. Make sure that's what you're gonna see on your screen, on your Google. If you appear that, you are safe. And still have some more tests. I'm gonna do some more tests, even, even after that, I still do more testing. I'm sure it's working, I've done already many times, but I'm still doing it, yeah? About that, we are sure, we are understanding. I hope this is gonna help you for fly sky and spectrum especially, because it send pulses. Even the lowest, it still send pulses. Remember, when you're bounding the spectrum, army must be on, your RTH must be on, and remember, this one, your trimming, don't use the, um, how do you call it, the, your sub trim or whatever you're gonna use, use just this one, the normal trim, put all the way down and bound through your receiver. That's all, that's what you have to do. And make sure appear that when you switch it off. Yeah? That's it. Now what I'm gonna do, I put up, fail safe, move up. There we are. Remember, to take a control when you go far away, they call trace hold. Basically, you need to move one of your stick. It doesn't matter if it's the accelerator or, or your elevator or roll, whatever you want. Move up, all the way up or down, whatever you want, or sideways or accelerate all, all the way up because it's gonna recognize you take a control. They call trace old. This is a program is in Cyan Hive. It recognizes you get out from RTH when you the radio is on. Remember about that. And make sure that this one is working so you can take the control back. Yeah? The video is too long. I don't want to be over the moon for the, the length of the video. I hope this is going to help you for the spectrum and non spectrum. And special for the beginner, this will help you. I hope to have done a good job to help someone lost. Uh, remember, there is a lot of things about the RTH, follow the INAV documentation. There is a lot more things I will go next time. It's go, the video is gonna be too long for RTH. I'll stop it here. And uh, for the beginner one, I'm gonna do a different video where I'm gonna go for INAV old tricks and tips. It will help you to set up RTH in full. So I'll stop here. This uh, the main reason I want to do is the radio. Set up radio through your receiver on your plane. That was the reason. For this video, I'll stop here. See you next time from Encina One. I hope the video like it, thumbs up, and uh, see you for next video. Bye-bye.